Hey, what's up, guys? This is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Sakucha, and my knife. I just had it. I was sharpening it. Hold on. All right. So, got my knife, and I keep having to wait till after the shark fishing uh, goes through to get it out to John. And we got another batch of harkoozies. There you go. And it says, T uh, take a kid fishing team hard live YouTube. Yes, sir. So we got a bunch of colors in. Um, we'll be throwing them in with uh, any of the purchases that we get through the shop. We got a lot of them there, which is pretty cool, guys, because we are still, you know, always pushing for the next generation to get out there and go fishing, guys. So it's those priceless moments that they'll remember forever and ever and talk about it to their kids. I mean, you don't ever hear them talk about the one day, oh man, when I reach this one level, me and my grandpa were sitting there. You never hear that story. You never hear it of them with their, their mom or dad and stuff. They, they reach a certain level and this and that. I mean, I can remember playing games as a kid when we were lucky enough to finally get one to borrow at a friend's house that they had the game and for us to go play. But now I can tell you tons of stories of fishing with my grandparents, fishing with my mom, fishing with my dad, you know, fishing with best friends, just endless stories of them. Food for thought, guys. So, uh, I've got a bunch of reels that I'm gonna be pulling out. Um, customers brought in their braided lines for us to spool up onto their reels. This is a solid braid because it's eight strand. What do we got here? This is Suffix 832, another solid right there. Some more. Definitely not shipping this stuff back. Um, got some cigar right here. Some 50 pound pine pack thread lock. This is 16 strand hollow core right there. And this is also 16 strand hollow core. They got 50 pound test. Which this is cool because I've never had a cigar fishing line in our house to be able to pull up and stuff like that. So we're going to be doing that. Again, guys, this is all braided line that customers brought into us. We've got to pull up all these reels, so I'm going to go ahead and do an unboxing. Ooh, that is pretty. It's a pink and black mix. Wow, that is nice. MXJ right there, very nice. And he's got a card on here that tells me what he wants spooled on here. So this one has the blue. It's got 600 yards on there, so that one will be with that one. Let's do this. <coughs> Same color reel and switch out the parts. I'm assuming this will be the white. Sure is. That'll be the white right there. Very nice. <clears throat> and we've got. Oh man, that is pretty. <laughs> A little too thin for my blood, but like I said, you know. Everybody fishes all different kinds of weight. Okay. So I definitely, I know I don't have this one in our YouTube channel, so this is going to be a great addition. Um, wow, that's cool. Oh, wait. There's a card in there. Sure does. Suffix 
This is the way he did it is probably the best way to do it. Normally we get a sheet, one sheet with all the different reels on there and stuff like that. And at least this way there's no confusion. I mean, granted, don't get me wrong, I mean, they do write it out pretty nice, but it's one sheet and I'd rather just grab that, concentrate on that focus there. But sometimes we do get distracted, guys. I am human and we got to pull up the reel first. Uh, I get sidetracked with customers asking their questions. And like I said, guys, I try to do the best I can to answer the questions from customers as they come in. And I use diamond. so much like a fly rail guys <laughs> it really does so we got over right here diamond hollow core blue and white so I guess I'm stripping this one down you hear the rain raining. It is shark -a -thon weekend, guys. They have put out that government did shut down, so it didn't shut them down, so that's a good thing. But yeah, that's, those are pretty reels. That's a pretty, pretty color combination right there. So, let's do this. We got this other reel was also brought into us yesterday to pull up for shark -a -thon. He originally wanted to go with monofilament. However, he is fishing the Carcathon tournament and asked us for some knowledge on it. And being in that land-based tournament, yes, the reels were, the original numbers came off of filling them with monofilament. However, you're on a, that's for guys on a boat. You're not gonna have a whole bunch of line capacity doing it that way, you know, filling it up like this. So right here he's got, um, I believe he said he had 800 yards of 50 pound mono on there. So what we're going to go ahead and do is strip it down and put yeah, Got a fire, got a fire. I think I got a, got a lot of stress on my mind. It's a nice day to go. Yeah, I got a line. I'm a caller, the whole team. We're going to be putting the 100 pound master braid on by Portland. And we're gonna fill it up that way. So, I've got a lot of spooling to do, guys. So let's go ahead and knock this out because I know this is just what we're getting done this morning. So we'll see what happens.
and you can see right here the double up end is actually where it ends right here very very strong knot awesome take this up let's go and get this one set up so here we go gotta turn the right direction That is 290 yards on the first one. Now we're going to go ahead and splice in and finish it off. Seven hundred yards of hundred pound on here, and I'm sorry I wasn't stopping before. I just remembered right now and stopped to tell y'all. Man, my bad, my bad. So we're gonna go ahead and continue on and see see where it goes. Nine hundred yards and still climbing. A thousand yards, yes, sir. That's twelve hundred yards. So, I'll go ahead and make it an even 1350. All right, there's 1,350 yards, 100 pound on the ZXW50 of the 12 strand Cortland 100 pound test. Yes, sir, very nice. So one down, <clears throat> two, four, six more reels to go.